Following the deadly officer involved shooting in Springfield, focus has turned to how to improve mental health crisis response in the community. Right now, one local state legislator is working to carve out funding for towns and cities to tackle this problem. Western Mass News reporter Leon Purvis joins us now live in studio with more. Leon. Jordan Chris State Representative Lindsay Sabadosa has been working on ways to help communities respond differently to certain emergency calls and to reevaluate the need to send police in some cases. So this would be an unarmed non-police response primarily to mental health or substance abuse related calls. State Representative Lindsay Sabadosa of Northampton proposing new legislation an act to create alternatives for community emergency services. It calls for the allocation of federal funding to towns and cities to set up a new way of responding to crisis calls traditionally covered by police officers. They can set up uh, a right-sized model of alternative emergency response. Sabadosa tells Washer Mass News the response system could vary by community. So their plan could include social workers, it could include behavioral health workers, it could um, include peer, um, peer response. It really depends on the community. She points out it is different when mental health experts lead the conversation with a person who may be suffering from a mental illness versus police leading it. But she says utilizing police as a backup may be needed in some cases. If you do need that backup, you have it, but you're starting off on the right foot of this is not, we are not, the police and I are not here to have a violent interaction with you. We're here to figure out how we de-escalate and help in this situation. Sabadosa tells us it comes down to learning more about a situation during the initial 911 call to know who should respond. If someone's running around with a knife because they're threatening to hurt themselves, that's a very different situation than, you know, I'm going to try and, and hurt other people. And that's where you need to have both. You need to have discretion and you need to figure out what's really going on. Sabadosa adds extra focus should also go to better training for dispatchers answering 911 calls. Live in studio, Leon Purvis, Western Mass News.